the women that I visited yesterday, in fact, she said, oh, now you graduate on Saturday. Then what are you going to do? And I said, I'll be right back here visiting you. Because that's exactly, I've, I, my, I have a job that I love. And I have no reason to change at this point in my life. And I have, somebody's got to do the bookkeeping for the business. So that's, that's me. I, my life won't change, except that I won't have to do schoolwork at night. <laughs> That'll be it. So. And do you think you'll um, get another degree or no. grad school? No, no, in fact, in fact, one of the women, when we went through the graduation fair, said to me, oh, Karen, you're getting your master's? And I said, no, don't even think it. It took me all these years to get a bachelor's. I'm done. <laughs> so that's it. Because if you started in 84, is that well, right? Yeah, well, in, in counting a year at the University of Minnesota, it's, you know, but yeah, otherwise it was 84. And then, so wait, so that is what, 30, is that 30, wait, hold That's on. That's a long time. So we went to like 2005, and then. 84, yeah. 94, 2005. So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> long time. Yeah. And um, so what, um, I guess, so will you uh, get a raise at work now that. No, <laughs> <laughs> no I'm afraid not. <laughs> um, automatic raises when on the afternoon job, but. The, when you own the company, you don't get automatic raises. <laughs> do um, now, uh, so h how do you feel that you finished this and accomplished this goal? I just feel sorry that I didn't do it sooner because my mother had said to me, "You've got to hurry up and get through school because I want to go to your graduation." And my mother died of Alzheimer's back in nineteen fourteen. I mean twenty twenty fourteen. Mm. So, and then my dad died two years later. So neither one of my parents got to see me graduate from college. Mm. So that's just sort of sad. They're going to be watching. Mm. 